Hi everyone, today I will show you how to quickly create a topography in Revit using 2D contour lines from AutoCAD. First thing we got to do is open up our AutoCAD file where we have our contour lines on one layer. This video is mainly directed to students and as we all know, we very often receive PDF with contour lines that we later export to AutoCAD. And this way we don't have to redraw the lines anymore to obtain a topography. So let's click one of our topography lines and then type MO shortcut. This will open a properties panel. We click on the elevation tab and then type in our desired elevation for this contour line. Now we are going to do the exact same thing on every single contour line. This does take some time, but it is definitely faster than redrawing every single line again. And also if we received an AutoCAD file from an engineer, these values might be already included in the file. This allows Revit to automatically detect the line's elevations in the later stages. So let's enjoy the speedrun of this for a minute. And in the meantime, click subscribe if you want to see more content like that. Also, if you have any tutorials that you would like to see on my account, write them down in the comments. And as a fellow university student, I would be happy to help. Now you can check your drawing in 3D and see how the contour lines look like now. Now we open our Revit file and we click New Architectural Template, OK, and we wait for our new drawing to load. Now we have to insert our AutoCAD file and the best thing is to link it, not just import it. So we go to the Insert tab and we look for Link Cut. We click the link card. As you can see, I have some issues finding it sometimes. And we load our file. And we unchecked correct lines that are slightly off axis. That's at the bottom of the page. You can see me unclicking it over here right now. And we open the file. The file is loading and we might have to zoom out to find our drawing somewhere there. And that's done. The cut is over here. And now we go to massing and side, topo solid, create from import, create from cut. And now window opens and we do check none and then just check the contours layer, which is the only layer with our contour lines. We click OK and our topography is being created. When we go to the 3D view, we can see that the topography is over here and it's perfectly done. We can adjust a few things at the later stages, add some elements, delete some elements, but that's a work for another time. And what I personally do later is export this Revit topography and import it to Rhino since I am using Rhino as my primary 3D modeling software but I found out that the topography is created more accurately in Revit so that's why I do create it in Revit. If you have any more questions regarding the topography, how I create some things maybe in Rhino, please let me know and I hope that this tutorial was helpful and let me know in the comments what you think and follow for more. Thanks guys, bye!